Hello YouTubers, yeah, the other guys who won Paul yet again with another deck profile. This time on my Dodo Birds on Steroids deck. Um, yeah, this deck goes. <laughs> really, um, I made a video of. Uh, me playing the Dodo Birds deck against uh, my girl's uh, Infernity deck. It beat the shit out of Infernity, so <laughs> it plays very well. It tests very well against all kinds of decks, so yeah. Let's go. Um, one Miss Valley Shaman. Uh, Shaman. Um, she's good. Yeah. Uh, two Miss Valley Thunderbirds. Uh, when he's uh, sent back to the hand, you can special summon. So, very good. This deck is all about um, returning cards to the hand. So, yeah. So, the cards get their effects uh, with uh, mm, the field spell card, or with Thunderbird, or with um, Birdman. Uh, they get their effects. So, yeah. Uh, two Miss Valley Soldiers, level 4 tuner. Uh, very good. Uh, some people play it at 1, but no man. Two. Two. Some people play Thunderbird at three, but no. Two. <laughs> then, well, three Miss Valley Falcons. Uh, for defense, also for synchro, but uh, mostly for defense. Really, or for tributing. Uh, when I have my Icarus attack, I'll tribute this guy. This is the guy I want to tribute, so yeah. Uh, those were the Miss Valley. Uh, two Genix Black fans. Um, only two, not three. Uh, two is enough, really. Two is enough. You, um, when you're doing the loop, you know the loop. Two is enough because you recycle the cards back into your deck um, quick, quickly. So no need for three. When you have two, you have gain, so yeah. But, then again, three Genix Ally Birdman. This is the main card of the deck, I think. It's the main card of the deck. That's my opinion. Um, when I get this guy and uh, the um, Miss Valley uh, Field Spell card, it's the Divine Wind. It's just crazy. And, of course, the number one card, Tengu. Still number one, guys. Tengu. Uh, this guy, this guy in your hand, activate the Divine Wind, Tengu, Tengu Special Summon, uh, with this guy, he's Special Summon, Tengu Special Summon from your uh, deck, uh, so he's back into your hand also, you can uh, Synchro Summon into an Ancient Fairy Dragon, Ancient Fairy Dragon is the most important Synchro card in this deck, uh, also with Morstronics, the deck list I showed you with the Morstronics, Ancient Fairy Dragon is the most important in Morstronics, but also in this deck. This deck is Ancient Fairy Dragon all over again, really. Um, you uh, get the loop with Birdman, Tengu, Special Summon Tengu, uh, you have Special Summon Birdman, then you can Special Summon uh, one Wind Monster, from uh, level 4 or uh, Wind Monster from your uh, deck with Divine Wind. So you uh, special summon the Blast Fan. You special summon Blast Fan and you get another Genus Ally Birdman from his effect to your hand. Uh, so you can use again. If you have Ancient Fairy Dragon, you blow up the field spell card. You can use another field spell card so you can use the effect of the uh, second field spell card again so tango again with blast fan or with tango whatever you want uh, so you can uh, synchro summon really swarm like crazy uh, yeah this deck swarms like crazy man once you get the right place for a uh, right play setup you uh, can't lose or your opponent has a dark wall or heavy and heavy storm in their hand okay that's, that's that, but yeah. Then the last monster of the deck, two Vortex Troopers. Uh, I know people who play one, but I play two. Why? Because you play two Genix Ally Blast fans, that's why. 
and also you play uh, one shaman, uh, two misspelling soldiers, you need to recycle them, Tengus also back into your deck. So you can uh, special summon Birdman Tengu to the hand, you have uh, um, arranged it back into your deck, the Tengu, so you can special summon Tengu again from your deck. So yeah, that's the combo, guys. It's a really good combo, that's why two. Uh, two good. Two is good. Not three, two. Perfect. Perfect two. Crap for space again. Every deck I make is fucking crap for space. So yeah, those were the monsters. Now, let's go on to the magic. This fucker. Divine Wind of Mist Valley. The best card there is. Your opponent really, really hates this card. <laughs> two terraforming. Now I run two in this deck because you really need to have your Divine Wind uh, to make your play setup. The only proxy card. This card is coming with the mail order uh, next week. Uh, it's the Quill Pen of uh, Gildos. It's a very good target two wind monsters in your grave. Uh, shake them back into your deck and uh, one card on the field back to the hand. So yeah, it's very good. Uh, you can also work on your Thunderbird. So you can special summon your thunder, uh, Thunderbird again. Uh, so yeah, very good. Uh, also Recycler again, a Recycler uh, for your Tangus for your Blast fans and for your Birdman, so you can loop, loop, loop all over again. Uh, but it's the only proxy I have, um, I don't have it yet. Next week I'll have it two times. Uh, play it two times, guys. The Quill Pen of Gildos, it's very good, really. Um, then, uh, two MSTs, one Monster Reborn, also one Feather of the Phoenix, to get your divine wind um, of Miss Valley back um, on top of your deck. So when your opponent MSTs, MSTs it, you have a feather, discard a card, uh, place it back on top of your deck so you can reuse it again. So you really need to have your divine wind, really. One dark hole, another recycler, pot of avarice. That's why I say you recycle a lot. That's why I say you don't need to run three blast fans because crap for space. Run two blast fans and you're all right, really. Um, because you run two vortex troopers also. So recycle, recycle. Uh, then the traps, three compulsories. Get those thunderbirds to the hands. Uh, you. Um, uh, your priority is to return your own monsters to your hand, but you know, Compulsory is a very good card in every deck, so yeah, it's a staple. To me, it's a staple. Uh, Solemn Judgment, one. One Bottomless Trap Hole. Two D Prisons. D Prison is just the best card there is, man. Torrential Tribute, and one Icarus Attack. Four. This guy. Really? For this guy. Icarus attack for this guy. Um, if I don't have him, I'll use it for him, but... Or her. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Once again, guys, uh, this deck is... Uh, to me, it's very good deck. It's a swarm deck. Uh, if you know how to play this deck, if you watch my um, video of me dueling with this deck against Infernities, you'll see how to play with this deck. Really, uh, you need to get your Ancient Fairy Dragon out quick as possible. Uh, but if you have the right hand, you have it as quick as possible. So yeah. Um uh, good. Thanks for watching. Yatagarasu one ball.